Got a great little game here. Nelvin Lowe versus Alex Zhang. CMS, second round. I have to be unbiased because I interact with both fellows. Alex doesn't have that focused look. He's about to get his ass kicked. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see. I guess I think the biggest factor in this game is going to be a matter of how consistent Nelvin will be over the course of the match. Wow, coming out firing this first round, or this first point. That was really good from both parties. Alex, fast three points, can he hold it? That was like immensely better than what I saw from him in the previous game where he lost in the second round of D's. All right, Melvin finally gets on the board. That's like two or three errors already, really fast to Nev Nelvin's overhead backhand side. And that's two winners to Nelvin by hitting that straight drop. Nelvin did that to me. He likes to stay in the hole, and Alex got punished, but he gets the point back from bad short serve. And then he gives it back from a bad long serve. I think Nelvin should just long serve every time. It's the safest. Indecision in the baseline for Nelvin. He's made a lot of errors in the baseline. Good clear. Match number four, D Kobe Chan, you have five minutes to default. Kobe Chan, you have five minutes to default. I hope that Nelvin didn't just like learn that the secret to beating Alex was doing that over and over. Just hitting it to his baseline, backhand. Producing a really slow backhand return and then rushing the net. What is Alex, Alex going to do? But instead he continues to short serve and then gets pushed and makes those errors. Oh my god, that was a shocking serve that ended up in. I like Nelvin's form when he smashes. It's been to Alex's body every single time. But it can work. Ryan Chang and Tina Lee, please support the return of the desk. 
Match number five, D women singles. You take the Ami Metal. Oh, stayed in it. Is Alex just cheesing winners here? I have no idea. I don't normally see him play for this. I wonder if he's overperforming or or what, because he was not good at all in the previous one. Damn. A lot of winners going to Alex's forehand side when Nelvin drops it. It's a really good shot of Nelvin's. Elvin needs to just hit to Alex's baseline. Hey, what's the score? 10-5. 10-15. Now the question is, can Alex keep this? Part of me feels like, no. I don't know why. Like, I think... Alex is starting to lose his edge because Nelvin is starting to understand how to play against Alex. Because he's just flicked Alex twice now. So I'm thinking that serving long is the way to go, but not serving long like that. That's atrocious. Yikes. Damn, the recipe's there but it's not coming to fruition because of execution. Kobe Chen, you have one minute to default. Match number five, D women singles. Yu Chang Lee, please report to the tournament desk. Your opponent is waiting for you. Yu Chang Lee. Too slow. Couldn't push off. Alex is doing a good job of just pushing it off of that shot. Wow, he got that over. Every time, I've seen so many winners off of just that straight drop. Hey, he's wearing a Macau China shirt. That's awesome. It's a cool shirt. Has a name on it. Oh man. Alex might take this game, but I'm less confident about the whole match based off of the second half of the game. Oh my god. He cannot execute the long serve. I think Alex needs to return Nelvin's drops far better than what he's currently doing it. I've seen a lot of winners go to Nelvin's way just from Nelvin dropping, Alex hit, hitting like a floaty little return and then Nelvin running up. Good lift. It's tight. It's tough. Oh no. Is it going to extra points if I'm not mistaken. 
Oh my gosh, Melvin stayed in the rally. How? How? <laughs> Alex is grinning. I wonder what he's thinking at this exact moment. How did I not seal that game away? He needed to kill it early. Hit with more vigor. Is this game about to get stolen from Alex? Confirmed, it got stolen.